now i am going to explain how saturation current remains same in a jfet now let's consider a jfet which is shown here in the figure 1 actually the gate voltage applied here is zero on the both sides and vds voltage that is drain source voltage is applied positive now consider four points somewhere in the channel that is 1 2 3 4 the point number 4 is very nearer to the drain and point number 3 is little bit far away from the drain and 2 and 1 as follows actually the channel behaves as a linear resistor that is assume here having some linear resistor like this so when the drain voltage is applied the voltage here will be more than a voltage at point number 3 because the resistor which is here will drop some amount of voltage and makes the voltage at 3 little bit lesser than the voltage at 4 which is the reason for not having the barrier uniform in a JFET. The thick green color thing shown here is the barrier and this is the N channel. Here that is at the point number 4 the voltage will be more. So obviously for N channel we are applying the positive voltage that means the reverse bias as the reverse bias is there for the diode the depletion region will increase so the barrier width will be more at the point 4 than at the point 3 when we increase the VDS so as we increase the VDS more and more this barrier will increase more and more so after some voltage VDS it will look like this that is the figure 2 where the both barriers will meet now the question is when the barriers are blocking the way for the current to flow then to how we can get the constant current in a saturation region for a JFET the reason for this is here the conduction current density of a JFET is given as K into E into W E is the electric field and W is the width of the path and k is given as nu nu is the mobility of electrons because it is n channel and n nd nd is the doping concentration as it is n channel it will be the donor concentration and e is the electric field present here and w is the width of the channel the electric field this is the electric field present here now see as the width decreases the electronic field is getting increased so here the width is gone decreasing but the electric field here is lot more to pull the electrons that is the reason for having the constant current in saturation region thank you